city. And now, more recently in the news, as in the last few days, Russian bombers intercepted by U.S. fighter jets near the Alaska coast. Recently, uh, we've seen a sharp escalation of Russian bombers intruding upon U.S. territories. It's been happening for years. I also think some people are getting numb to it when they shouldn't. So while World War has not begun over these incursions yet, it's possible that the powers, that being, could allow an incident to occur in order to get the wheels of war into motion. There really shouldn't be this many incursions. And we're not just talking about Russian jets, we're talking about Russian, Chinese submarines, other weapons of war. These events are becoming more and more common. And it makes it easy for the mainstream media and the global military industrial complex, right, to make excuses for their increased military spendings. Instead of, of course, you know, prevent a war from beginning in the first place. Also, Russia's revealed images of a militarized base in the Arctic. These images were once considered top secret. However, with so many scripted events in this theater of war, why assume that the revelation of this Russian base in the Arctic, why assume that this is an accident? Here's what's on the menu for next week. Missile technology transfers to China. Russian special forces training in Colorado back in 2012. We have the news clip of it. Chinese police training in Leak City, Texas. China's influence over Hollywood and the latest chess piece moves towards a hot global war that could lead eventually to the occupation of U.S.